hallelujah god bless you you're welcome to this prophetic session i'm sure you you welcome to my youtube channel prophetic moments with sure fun god bless you in the mighty name of jesus amen i have this prophetic word and the lord says you need to hold on you need to hold on because it is going to happen everything he told you every promise he made to you to a prophet through your vision, through your dreams, through you, he says it is going to happen. All you need is to hold on, obey every instruction along the way, and hold on. You see, I remember the story in the book of Genesis chapter 12, from verse 2, the Bible says, God calls Abraham and tells him, I will bless you. I will make your name great and through you shall all the nations of the earth be blessed. Anyone who curses you is cursed and anyone who blesses you is blessed. Those were the promises that God made to Abraham. And he told him your descendants are going to be as many as the stars in the sky and as many as the sun on the seashore side. Those were the promises he gave Abraham. You see, and Abraham had to wait holding on to those promises that promise was made to abraham in the book of genesis chapter 12 and around genesis chapter 20 18 20 20 something where we begin to see that the prophecies were manifested it took 25 years 25 good years before Abraham could see the manifestation of the promises that God had made to him. Not as though God was wicked. Not as though God wanted to punish him. But God was working out something in Abraham. 25 good years. But it came to pass. You see, while Abraham was going through the season of waiting, there were days where he felt like giving up. In the book of Genesis chapter 15 or chapter 17, the Bible speaks there of a moment where God comes to Abraham and tells him, I will bless you. And Abraham says, what do you want to give me? I still don't have a son and my servants will become my heir because I am childless. God, what do you want to give me? Because that was just a sign of, of how tired, how frustrated he felt. Yet God still comforted him and told him, I will do what I said I will do. The Lord has sent me to tell you that, hold on, because he will do what he says he will do. Before you know it, you will be in your testimony. You will be in your miracle celebrating your testimony. Don't give up on God. He is about to manifest those words in your life. 